Hey, did the Russian cut you a deal on the good stuff? Eight ounces, pure. Ooh, lovely, it's our anniversary. Tracy's gonna expect the very best. Mm -hmm. And my little Martinette does love her caviar. This is gonna knock her garters off. You charged it to her credit card, right? Of course I did. I just hope she shows up. Oh, she'll show. It's our anniversary. She's going to know that I will be laying out the red carpet, and she will want to rub my nose in it. Well, maybe she's waiting for you to give chase. You know, her pride has been wounded. It's nothing that a bucket of champagne and a sea of caviar won't cure. And a little groveling, I think. And grovel I shall, my son. As soon as she shows her lovely face, I will be prostrate with mortification. Well, you certainly get points for confidence. Well... I've never been one to underestimate my own charm. So, mosey over to the quartermain, see if she's back yet. Give me a call. I need to know her mood so this thing's going to work right. You are a lunatic. Kidnapping me and locking me up? Will you stop this infernal shrieking? Uh, how does Luke put up with you? Maybe that accounts for his frequent escapes to Park oh, Unknown. Shut up and let me out. Didn't your parents teach you to say please? Helena, what do you want from me? Nothing. You are merely an annoyance and a means to an end. What end? Well, sooner or later, and one does have to hope for sooner, Luke will come looking for you, and then I'll have him too. Why kidnap me when you could have just as easily kidnapped Luke? Well, let's just say I have a plan. And in order for my plan to work, I need both of you. Dodge, what's going on? The flowers are wilting, the pate is melting, my aftershave is starting to turn. Look, I don't care if she's spitting nails. Get her over here, pronto. Tell her that I'm uh, redoing the casino and I'm holding a hooker convention. Oh, hey, I think the uh, eagle has landed. Well, you took your sweet time. I always do. Nice. Come in. Nibble on my strawberries. Ooh, that sounds quite appealing, but somehow I don't think this lovely romantic setting is meant for me. Well, there's only you and me here. Well, you sidestep that quite nimbly. Didn't I? So, what should we drink to? About your anniversary. So, how did you know it was my anniversary? Did you hear me talking to Ethan on the phone? No. It happens to be a date I'll never forget, Luke. You and I were doing pretty well, I think. And I'm not ashamed to admit that I've gotten myself pretty attached, and I think you felt the same way. I did. Then you went and ruined it all by marrying Tracy. But I suppose things happen for a reason, don't they? If we had never parted ways, I wouldn't have had a beautiful baby girl. Do you ever imagine what if? I don't like to let my mind go there. At least not too often. We don't have to close the door on those memories. We could uh, relive them. There's no time like the present. Well, you certainly talk a good game. I do more than talk. You love Tracy. And even though she doesn't deserve you, Luke, you do deserve happiness. So enjoy your anniversary. And best of luck to both of you. Uh, uh, Blaze! Uh, I got fish eggs. <sighs> hey, girl, where's, where's Tracy? Did you scare her away already? No, the eagle that landed wasn't Tracy, it was Skye. Spanky never showed. She, uh, she wasn't at the quarterman house either. So they haven't heard from her. No calls. 
No email, there's nothing. Oh, she's probably spending her anniversary in the Bahamas, lounging in the sun, bedding cabana boys. Hmm. Thought of that. So I drove down to the airport, ELQ jet still in the hangar. Really? Mm -hmm. I wonder where she is. Yeah, she's probably nursing her grudge somewhere, or baiting me to go and search for her. She's in real trouble. Those moths are impervious to everything. They can't be picked, I assure you. Luke is on his way, and when he gets here, you are going to regret taking me captive. Ah, such blind faith in a faithless husband. It's touching, really. Luke has beaten you before. He will beat you again. Well, I look forward to his attempt. You know, Luke and I have enjoyed a delicious rivalry over the years, but it doesn't look like he misses you very much. For your information, today is my wedding anniversary, and when I don't show up, he will come gunning for you. Well, I certainly hope you're right, because it's been far too long since I've had the pleasure of watching Luke walk into one of my traps. <laughs> 